My name is Johnny Bottlecap. Pleased to meet your acquaintance. I was born and raised in Vault 86, the place I finally call home. Both my parents passed away when I was just a young child. To tell you the truth, I don't have too many memories of them to speak of. I more or less grew up an orphan, being raised collectively by the fine residents of Vault 86. I'd do anything for those lovely people, even risking the unknown to secure our future. My whole life I've tried my darndest to make Vault 86 the best place to live as possible. If there's a volunteer needed for any job, big or small, Johnny is always your guy. I'd always be up for taking care of odds and ends around the vault, stepping in wherever I was welcome. When I got to my teenage years, I find myself recruited into an experimental procedure that apparently all of the Vault 86 residents are subjected to. Experiments were performed with the goal of unlocking the full potential of the human mind. And wouldn't you know it, they even seem to have succeeded in more than one case. Some of the experiments went beyond the wildest expectations, bestowing a sort of hyper-intelligence to the test subject, while others, like myself, who went through the experiment, ended up much worse for wear. Unfortunately, it would also seem that in certain rare cases, the experiment can be fatal. I came to learn shortly after my own procedure that both my parents had passed away when they had gone through the same process as I had. Not very long after being a test subject, I started to hear rumors of an amazing, legendary device that had the potential to restore myself, and others like me, to their pre-experimentation state. This device, known as the Biological Regressive Augmented Intelligence Nebulizer, or brain, was said to have the ability to completely reverse the negative impacts of the experimentation. Well, I'm sure you would have guessed it, but as soon as old Johnny heard that there might be some way to help out my fellow Vault 86ers get their lives back, well, I jumped at the chance to be the one to bring that legendary brain home. My fellow residents were quick to agree with me because before you knew it, I was appointed the champion of our vault and set with the task of obtaining the brain and return with it to help my people. Fast forward to me taking my first steps outside of Vault 86 into the unknown dangers of the wasteland. It didn't take me very long to realize that I may not have had all the necessary survival skills to make it out on the wasteland all on my own. This meant that I would need to find some reliable traveling companions, and quick at that, if I wanted to have any chance at surviving to complete my quest. Eventually, I came across two wonderful companions, Yuri and the Rifleman, both very capable and competent individuals with enough survival experience to circle the globe ten times over. I've learned a lifetime of lessons from these gents in just a short amount of time. Now old John is not one to take without giving anything in return, so I have been more than happy to volunteer my expertise in solving problems wherever our party has traveled to. Although I was sent out into the wasteland with only the supplies on my back, there were a few times where I thought I was for sure a goner, yet somehow managed to survive. Now, I can't say for certain, but each time I was backed into an unwinnable situation, there seemed to be some mysterious, shadowy figure who would intervene in my conflict and lend just enough assistance that I could disengage and head for safety. Now, maybe I'm just dreaming this all up, but it seems that perhaps old Johnny has got himself a bona fide guardian angel. Thank you so much for watching Wastelanders, and if you liked this video, then please subscribe to WGNR on YouTube and consider heading over to my Patreon and Streamlabs pages. On Patreon, you can get exclusive rewards, including video shoutouts, access to polls, which will help guide future WGNR content, and you can even become immortalized as a named character in a future WGNR video. If monthly donations aren't in your budget, then Streamlabs might be the way for you. There you can get some cool WGNR merchandise and make a one-time donation to help keep the channel alive. Your donations mean that I can make more content more often and continue to expand the type of programming that you get to watch on WGNR. So again, thank you so much for watching and until next time, WGNR will be back.